Hey everybody, Secondhand Dan down here in Florida land. I'm at Howard's Flea Market. It's only like uh, two miles from my house, so I ended up here periodically as a buyer. I've attempted to sell here in the past, but uh, it didn't really work out for me trying to sell. But it's still a nice place to come. It's fun, interesting stuff, interesting people. So we're going to start off here in uh, the H-Wing. It's a little late in the afternoon. It's muggy. It's like 90 degrees. Uh, we're actually hoping to pick up some batteries for just a few dollars rather than pay full retail somewhere else. Maybe get something to, to nosh on. Got the wife with me. That's her. That's her behind. You've been nosh. <laughs> no, I didn't film her behind. She's, she's leaning into the car right now. I played her. I said, hey, there's her behind. But no, but she, uh, she'll make a, a smiling appearance here in a moment. So I'm going to start walking towards row H, H wing as it is. Look who's coming up behind me. Walk home. Because if he would have showed you that end, he'd have been in trouble. <laughs> I don't know, I'm pretty proud of that. Alright, here we go into the H Wing. Guitars! Hey guys. I need a pair of suspenders like that. That way you can tell how long you've had them on. They got low ceilings in here. That's the only thing I find a little peculiar about this place. I mean, I can reach up and touch it. But other than that, the uh, place works for me. Check this out. This is the uh, don't replace it, reglaze it. We actually uh, use their services. They reglazed our bathtub here in Florida. Pleased with it. We are on the search for C-type C batteries. <laughs> I've been coming to this market for uh, well over two years now. And I can still get the feeling of being a little bit lost because they have so many intersections. Dude! Go! Yeah. Hot and muggy. They got fans in the ceiling. So if you like it hot and muggy and you like hot air blowing back down on you, this, they heat the air up at the ceiling and then blow hot air down on you. Well, you're uh, uh, this lady here. I rejected a paycheck. I know, this lady Lots of turtles. It's going to be at the end. This. Uh, 
All right, let's hear it for Snoopy. Yard art made out of tin. There's Wilma hanging out with Wiley. There's the E wing. Now the wife has uh, gotten a couple uh, leagues ahead of me. She thinks she knows where she's going, but she's mistaken. So, but we'll still get there. They say that people move at a slower pace here in Florida. So they refuse to move over five miles an hour. It's unusual, but uh, sometimes I slip on a pair of shoes at home, treat them like a pair of slippers, and I didn't change into my sneakers. So it looks like I got my dancing shoes on. They're actually floor shimes, and they seem to have some kind of metal cleat in the heel. But I should have changed shoes, but... Oh, here's some puppies. Say, lots of intersections in this place. You go that way. Well, we came from that way. You go this way, that way, or that way. Our car is down there, but just in case you don't have one, I don't want to walk because some here is that store. Okay, I'm going to drive in. We're halfway up here. Don't put you in it any more or any less. Are you getting smart? Are you being a smart outlet? Oh, do I need to stop and get some liquid refreshment? You want to get a fresh, uh, you want a beer? That's your refreshment? Usually when I come to this place. These people might. You sell C batteries? Yeah, the majority of the people are closing up. Hot dog. A lot of hot dogs. Hello, guys. This flea market varies a lot from one in Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh, they don't let you sell any pets. They don't even want you, quote, bringing in your, your, your little doggy. But here, people are always walking their dogs, big dogs and little dogs on leashes. And, Sorry. and they're always selling puppies and parakeets. And we can find some people selling lizards and snakes. This is the dollar store and more. We suspect maybe we'll find some C-sized batteries in here. Just loving this humidity. It feels like I just got out of the shower in a small bathroom after taking a hot shower. 
Probably good for the pores though, right? Everywhere you turn, the puppies are there. Hi right, guys. Well, it doesn't look like we're buying anything here today. I don't mind the little walk around. As a body at rest tends to stay at rest. Need some pickles? Pick a pickle. Slice pickles, sauerkraut, jalapena, sweet and spicy. Lots of pickles here at Howard's Flea Market. People here love to deal in Rayobi. I am not a Rayobi person in the least. They do have a smattering of Dewalt. That's me, Dewalt, but looks like chargers. Yeah, I'm not seeing any Dewalt tools. Maybe down there on the end. Yeah, there's just a handful of Dewalt. Tell me what you guys think, you know, when it comes to cordless tools. I've been doing uh, Dewalt now for the past 15 years. Before that, I had some Porter cables, but that's before everybody was in the market. My Porter cables worked out, they still will work. And they've got to be 20 years old or more. See what the heat will do you? It'll wipe you up. Captain's quarters. I've been known to stop there once in a while. Another thing about Florida flea markets, they all sell beer. Not in Pittsburgh, though. I think the wife made a wrong turn. There must be those people down the place down here. So for, for what? For the batteries. Are you still looking for batteries here? I thought I you were talking about leaving. Oh. I know, but the black lady told me okay. about somebody up here. So I was... Um, checking it out. And if I would have found them, then I'd have got us some food here. But so we going to the car now? Going to the car. Where's the car? Taking the shortcuts to get to the car. I gotta learn to keep my finger out of the picture, huh? It's always like right there. 
Okay, that's some uh, different accents on this Nissan. To each his own. It feels like it, it may rain. A lot of cloud cover, but warm breeze coming through. I guess there's somebody that actually lives at the flea market. I don't know why they do a better job of leveling that uh, fifth wheel, though. It looks like it leans to one side. Right, back at the car. Right here on the grounds is a, uh, I guess, a small type of RV park. I don't think people here are uh, in it for the atmosphere. Could be snowbirds. It's just getting a great rate because you're parked basically on Howard's flea market property. But if you like the nightlife and you live in that RV park, this is where you want to go. The dog house. <laughs> All right. Well, I think we're done here, folks. Thanks for riding along to the uh, Howard's flea market. Bye-bye. Now, like I said before, thanks for uh, tagging along at the flea market. Uh, I thought, well, may as well go into this place, too. The uh, Sheriff's Ranchers Enterprises. Thank you. Ooh, is it cool in here? Don't get that at the flea market. Books. Books. DVDs, cassettes, VHS. Lots of furniture, stuffed furniture, lots of it. I come into these places hoping to find something that uh, the staff didn't really understand what they had and they priced it uh, rather low and I'm able to buy it and resell it but that doesn't happen too often in the secondhand stores most of the people are putting uh, the stuff that they've looked themselves on the internet then they're putting the price tags on them I have no idea about this it's just interesting to look at bass guitar preamp hundred dollars I'm not even going to bother to, to look that one up thing with electronics if you got to sell them on the internet you need to make sure you you test them They'll come around them bite you and even after you test them, you still have to hope that whoever you send them to doesn't do something ridiculous like plug the wrong voltage into them or and then say, it's all your fault, you sold me a bad one. This is kind of cool. I've got a video, video, a YouTube on a uh, planer that I picked up. If you haven't seen that one, Joiner. This is a nice unit. What do they want for it? Mine's got wooden legs on it. 100 bucks. That's not bad if you're going to take it home and, and love it. Not sure though what the, uh, I guess maybe the motor broke bolts on to there. Uh, probably isn't rocket science getting this thing up and running. 
I said, I've got a nice one. It's like from 1959, Craftsman. And it's here in Florida with me, and I would take it home to Pittsburgh if it wasn't ridiculous uh, amount of effort it would take to do that. Because we're going back in a car, for one thing. And it doesn't look like I'm going to be pulling any kind of trailer. For right now, there's no hitch on the car, and I don't own a trailer. Hey, Halloween ain't that far away, huh? Well, Easter's come and gone. Oh, this is cool. Twenty bucks. I've got several things kind of like this. They make good lamp bases. Look at that primitive GoPro case. We're going underwater. Fisher. Fisher what? What is it? Six dollars a box. Oh, uh, there's some kind of a uh, wire tie. Drill a hole in the block and put this tie in it. Mojack. Yeah, I don't see anything. We just happen to be next door at the uh, dollar store, which is now the dollar and a quarter store. It was actually cheaper to get our batteries there than it was to get them at the flea market. We've got a secret corner down here. Let's see what's down in the the secret corner. Uh, file cabinets, folding chairs, balance beam scale, divider. Keep your pet in the back. Teeter totter. Nice roof window skylight. There's a screen in it. It opens up, okay. Stretcher. Some kind of uh, mailboxes. You guys can probably hear my, my shoes clicking on the floor. All right, well. I better find the wife. I don't know if she actually came into this store or not. I left her next door. And I don't want to leave her out in the heat. I just assumed she would follow me over here. Oh, I should look in the clothing section. It's usually if she's here where I'm going to find her. All right, let's 
Somebody's just chilling, huh? Time to go. All right, well, that's what the second hand uh, sheriff, sheriff ranchers sale. Oh, we are hoping to find the right sectional, but this is actually uh, two sofas big one and a little one. All right, well, something to think about. Goodbye again. In case you didn't think it was hot enough today, we have the fireplace going. I'm pretty sure that's the one that was up at Dudley's auction. Cool. Well, warm. All right.